Well, here's a story that'll make you feel good on this Friday. Yeah, two police officers going beyond the badge and using their own money to help a kid move forward with his life, literally. Ten on your side's Laura Queso is in the newsroom with the story. Laura? Anita, Tom, two cops walk into a pawn shop looking for a bike. They find one, pay cash, they walk out. But here's the thing, the bike wasn't for them. It's this picture that's circulating on social media. You want to see something? Lori Lamoth, the saleswoman at Superior Pond on Virginia Beach Boulevard, snapped it and posted it after she saw cops walk in and do something she calls selfless. I saw two um, police cars pull in the parking lot and they came in and they asked if they could, if we had any bikes for sale. And she did. It would be so easy for them not to um, go the extra right now and to see them do that was really made me proud. We're told the officers offered to give a kid a ride on Tuesday as he was walking on the street. That's when they found out his bike was stolen, his only mode of transportation to get to and from work. So the officers said they wanted to replace it for him. The cops didn't want the recognition, but they're getting it. 160. And that led them here. These are the officers that are out here. For Lori, it's not the type of happy ending she expects when she sees officers walk into the pawn shop. People do commit crimes, and, and we definitely work with the police officers to help anybody that has been a victim of that. But yeah, it was nice to have a good visit from them. A good visit and a good ending to this story. And I'm told the officers also bought the boy a bike lock. We reached out to Virginia Beach Police. Of course, we wanted to talk to these officers and say thank you. We're told they really don't want the recognition, but if you're watching, we appreciate you, and that good deed has not gone unnoticed. I'm in the newsroom tonight, Laura Queso, 10 on your side.